Hello, good evening. Hi, hi. Hello, good evening. Hello, how are you today? I'm fine. Excellent. attendance and then we start. Same. Today is October the fifth. Time is really, really flying. Hello, hello, hello. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Fine, thanks. And you? ¿Cómo le pegó la vacuna? Todo bien. Venga, la. ¿Y cuál le pusieron? Eh, Pfizer. ¿En serio? Sí. Todo bien, no, no, no hay reacción, no hubo nada, <ríe> hubo ejercicio, <ríe> no me ha afectado, todo lo contrario, Ángel. <ríe> sí, pues sí. Sí, sí, es que a Ángel le pusieron la AstraZeneca, entonces. Sí, correcto. Ok, o sea que algunos les ponen, ¿dónde se la puso? Ah, es porque está en Aguachapán, ¿verdad? Sí, correcto. Y Ángel, Ángel es Pero... Santa Tecla. <ríe> correcto. Aunque creería yo que depende de la que tengan en disposición en el momento, porque eh, en el seguro estaban este, aplicando las dos, AstraZeneca y Pfizer, pero creería yo que alguna, alguna... ¿Y a usted cuál le habían puesto? Anteriormente la Sinovac. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Sí, lo, eso fue lo extraño que... Pues no sé por qué Pfizer y no Astra. Mejor. Sí, en parte mejor. Y con la otra estaría ahí ahorita. Probablemente, sí. Me lo único sí que hay un dolor, pero creería yo que es por lo mismo, ¿verdad? ¿Qué le que este ejercicio, el, el donde me pusieron la vacuna. Eso es normal. Ajá, cabal, pero más que todo es porque hice ejercicio, creo yo que no. ¿Cómo hizo ejercicio? ¿Fue al gym? Ajá, exacto. Te recomiendan que, es que no vaya al gym ni el día anterior, ni el día de la vacuna, ni el día después. Pero como fíjese que las anteriores vacunas hice lo mismito. Dije yo, no, y esta vez voy a hacer igualito, voy a, decir, voy a ir para sacarme todo eso. Tiene que hacer caso. No, mover el brazo sí, pero... Y fíjese de que sí, la otra vez igual, todo bien, no me afectó. Y con la otra no daba nada, nada, nada. Sí, nada. igual no daba nada. Uh -huh. Así es, pero, pero bueno, gracias a Dios, aquí estamos. A ver, let's see, Ángel is here, Ángel. Present teacher. Ok, ya oyó, ¿verdad? <risa> Bien, Galán. Ok, Aristides. Present. Denia. No, teacher, sorry. Present. Ok. I was a, a, a call. 
Okay. Edwin. Edwin. Oh, yeah, Edwin. Hmm, that's strange. Two days in a row without Edwin. Fatima. Present teacher. Nice. Adebish. Isabel. No, here, yeah, Isabel. Present teacher. Okay. Luis. Present teacher. Okay. Maria Martinez. Maria, Maria. No, here, yeah, Maria. Maricela. Maricela. Arlene. Present. Okay. Maura. Present. Nidia. 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 No, here, Nidia. Oscar. Oscar. Ricardo. Ricardo. I saw you driving. Present, present teacher. Okay. Teresa. Present teacher. Walter. Walter, Walter. Present teacher. Where are you? Okay. Yo dije, perdieron otra vez estos niños. Aquí estoy, aquí estoy. Okay. Yesenia. Yesenia, Yesenia. Y Yesenia, me han perdido también. Yuri. Present teacher. Okay. Very good. A ver, I see new people here. Edwin. Maria? Present teacher. Don Edwin, ahí está, teacher, pero el micrófono como que no le sirve el audio. ¿En serio? No? Sí, pero ahí está. Present no. teacher. Hello, oh, I see you. Ok, Maricela. Maricela. Nidia. Nidia, Nidia, Oscar, Oscar, uy, no me había visto dónde tenía el dedo yo poniendo dos en vez de poner uno, qué barbaridad, vaya, Maricela, no here, no, Nidia, and Oscar, ok, bueno, who has it? Ah, okay, somebody's out. Well, let's go. Así como dice en el, en el juego, let's go. A ver, what do you remember? What do you remember about the activities we were talking about yesterday? Uh -huh. What do you remember? WH uh, questions. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What else? Um, present continuum, simple, uh, simple present. Uh, uh -huh. Activities. Okay. The present continuous, yes. When do we use the present continuous? In what cases? When is when is passing in right now. Mm -hmm. When the activity is, is, is right now. Um, uh, for example, uh, writing. Mm -hmm. uh, writing right now or uh, receive the English class. Okay, I'm writing. What are you writing? 
um, the the date and and another point <laughs> for for <Okay>. attention. <laughs> I'm writing right now because I'm writing the date, I'm writing a lot of things, right? Okay. Well, we are going to make a mini review of what we were talking about yesterday. Let me check. All right. Remember, we have been talking about present continuous. And again, I want to refresh the rules, right? Just give me a second. There are some rules that we have for the ING form, right? So you have to be careful that the changes. What is the form of the verb that we need to use for the present continuous? Who can tell me? What's the form of the verb? Check. For the present continuous, we have to keep in mind that we need to use the baby form of the verb, right? And that is very, very important. Remember, we use the verb to be and the verb in the ing form. So you say, what are you doing? Oh, I am playing in a team, right? I am reading a, a very interesting book in English. Yeah. Okay. That you have to keep in mind that you use the verb to be and the other verb in the ing form. So you cannot say, I am play. Mm -mm. I am playing. I am running. I am working, right? I am playing soccer. I am learning a new language. I am traveling, right? Okay, so the verb has to be in the ing form. And remember, we were talking about some rules that for most of the verbs, we only add ing, but when the verb finishes in e, we have to eliminate the e and then add ing, like in the case of make, trade, change, take, wait, dance, come, that we have to eliminate the e and then add the ing. Okay, so that's something to keep in mind, right? We were saying, we were saying yesterday that we use the present continuous in different forms or in different cases. For example, a fraction happening now, right? Actions happening now. So that means right now I am doing something, but in this specific moment, right? In this specific moment, I'm doing something. So for example, Ricardo is driving, right? At the moment, he's driving his car. Judy is having dinner, right, Judy? Are you having dinner? Yes, teacher. Okay, so you see, when I see when I see you with the camera closed, I know you're having dinner, right? <laughs> okay, so we say Judy is having dinner. Yes. Maria is listening to the teacher. Are you listening, Maria? Yes. Maria, Maria, hello. Mm -hmm. Isabel is hiding in the dark. Yes. Hello, teacher. So, are you listening to the teacher? 
Yes, no. Yes. <laughs> okay, so you see, we're talking about actions that are happening now or at the moment, right? Also, we use it uh, to talk about temporary actions. And today, we are going to concentrate a lot in the temporary action. Check what are the temporary actions? When we're talking about something that is happening, not necessarily now, but around now, right? And we say we're looking for a new house at the, at the moment. So if you know of any, you tell me. Right? I'm looking for. I'm looking for a new house. What are you doing? Hmm. I'm looking for a new house. I'm traveling. Yes. I am painting the fence. Probably you are in Metro Centro. Metro Centro Santa Ana, Huachapán, San Salvador. <laughs> the Metro Centro. <laughs> so, so, nothing. so probably, probably you are walking in Metro Centro, hanging around. And then you say, hey, what are you doing? Hey, what are you doing? Oh, I'm painting a fence. You're spilled with paint on your shirt, right? Are you painting the fence exactly at that moment? Mm -mm. No. It's a temporary action, right? It takes, it takes some time, not exactly just that moment when you're speaking. So this is different from this right? Okay, check this. We were saying that we also use the present continuous for current changing and developing situation. I know the earth is getting hotter and hotter. So that's changing, right? That's a changing situation. And you know that with the global warming, that is changing every single day, right? The prices are increasing all the time. They are increasing, they are getting bigger, right? The children are growing and growing. Yeah, so you are saying that this is a changing or a developing situation, right? So you, can, you are learning more and more, right? So, and you see, we tend to repeat the, the comparative to show that something is changing, right? So you say, hey, you're learning more and more every day. You're working better and better, right? So you are developing something, okay? What expressions are we going to use now? At the moment, at present, these days, nowadays, today, tonight. So you say, my mother is cooking at the moment. I'm going dancing tonight. This is future. And this is an action happening at the moment of speaking. Now, what about if I say I'm learning English these days? I'm talking about present continuous, but I'm not talking about a future situation. And I'm not talking either about something that is happening at the moment, right? I'm talking about a temporary action. Okay. Right now, we're going to play memory game. Let's see how good you are. You already saw where the things are. So let's see. Uh, choose the numbers. Tell me number one and number. Hmm. So we see what happens. If you can find uh, the pairs, we're going to make pairs here. Ready? Ready. Uh -huh. Tell me. 
um, number seven. Tell me the two numbers, seven and? Seven and three. Yes. You saw the picture. <laughs> okay, let's see another my, one. My intuition. Oh, yeah, sure. Aha. Uh -huh. Run and run. Mm -hmm. Another one? Five and twelve. Five and twelve. Uh oh, no. Oh, wait, wait, wait. You're supposed to go to the man. This. Que no se van. Uh -huh. A ver. We said one and. No, seven and three, right? Okay. Seven and three. Yes. Another one. Two and eight. Two and eight. Yes. <laughs> no. And I have to disappear again. Two and five. Two and five. Five, five and two. I'm going to it. Five. Who would it be? Five and two. Yeah. Okay. Let's make another one. Three and seven. Yeah. Yeah. Three and Louis. seven. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. Um, eight and ten. Eight and ten. No. No. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Seven, three. Which one? Two and five. <laughs> Ah. You told me to buy, okay. Look for another one to match with the five. Uh, one. one, one. Are you sure? Yes, okay. Ten and twelve. Ten and twelve. Mm -hmm. I <laughs> tricky, tricky, tricky. Try with the arrow, teacher. Con arrow, con arrow. Ah, sí, con el arrow, pero. Bye. Vamos a ver. Seven and three. A ver. No, two and five. One and eight. One and eight. One and eight. Yes. Ajá. Which one? Eight. Eight. Ah, no. Nine, 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 Dance, walk, run, cry, read, read, and write. Okay? Okay. Hey, good, good. Vamos a ver. La próxima no va a salir mejor este memory. But let's, <laughs> let's see uh, with the present continuous. Remember, we were saying that we use it for temporary habits and temporary situations, yeah? Temporary habits, temporary situations. But you will say, pero que significa eso? Que significa? 
-hmm. What does it mean a temporary, a temporary situation? That is um, only during a, a minute and second, and um, then and then uh, pass it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we talk about temporary situation, check, and then we will come back. We can also use this tense for other kinds of temporary situations, even when the action isn't happening at the moment. Alguna veces no va a estar pasando, right? So you say, John's working in a bar until he finds a job in his field. He's working there now, right? Probably in this moment, he's walking around, but you say he's working in a bar until he finds in the field. Probably John is an engineer, but he's working in a bar until he finds a job as an engineer. And check the explanation, he might not be working now. So, no ahorititita estamos hablando, but he has a job there. So every day he gets up and he goes to the bar to work, right? I'm reading a really great book. Hmm, I don't see you the book. Uh -huh, no, I'm not reading it here, but I started reading it one week ago. And every time I can, I continue reading. Yes. So that's a temporary situation. She's staying with her friend for a week. She's staying for a week. It's a period, right? It is taking ya no un periodo chiquito así de que está pasando justo ahorita, sino que empezó antes y sigue, right? So it's a progress. It's an activity going in progress, but it's taking a more or a bigger period of time. Now look at this. He's eating a lot these days. What about if you're an actor and you have to gain weight? You will say, huh? He's eating a lot these days. So he's getting a lot of weight to be ready for the movie, right? For the film. And the expressions that you use, they say, at the moment, these days, okay? This month, these weeks, so you can even change, right? And this is temporary habits. But then you can talk about temporary situations. For example, I'm living in London at the moment. I'm living in London at the moment. I'm working in a food company for a couple of months, right? It's an action that is happening, well, as I told you, beginning some time before and continuing into progress. Es una situación temporal, sí, pero usted la está haciendo en ese momento, right? And these are the expressions that we are going to use. So say at the moment, for a few weeks, for a couple of months. And remember what we said before, it's not that you are doing that activity exactly, exactly right now, right? So when you say, I'm learning English and you are walking in Metro Centro, right? I'm learning English. Yo no te veo aprendiendo, ni siquiera vas aprendiendo, vas hablando inglés, le pueden decir, pero se dice ya. I'm learning English these days, right? I'm learning English these days. I'm working as a, imagínense si está haciendo un, 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 ¿cómo le llaman? Interinato, right? I'm working as a second grade teacher for a couple of months. Yeah. I'm working as a second grade teacher 
for a couple of months. You start the last month and you will finish in November. Yeah. It's some time, it's some period. It's a temporary situation. Are you a second grade teacher? Probably no. Yeah, probably no. But for a couple of months, you're working as a second grade teacher. Yeah. Imagine you are in a store. Okay, ahí lo estoy ubicando en varios contextos, right? El dueño de la tienda no está. Y usted dice, well, I'm attending the store at the moment. Yeah? It's a temporary situation. No va a quedarse en la tienda todo el tiempo, solamente por un periodo de tiempo. Okay? Now. This is what we said before, right? It's a, you use this tense for other kinds of temporary situation. Even if the action is not having exactly that moment, but it's taking some time. John is working in a bar until he finds a job in the field. John is working as a teacher until he finds a job in his field. Job is, John is driving a taxi until he finds a job in his field. Eso sucede, right? Or oh, John is working as an Uber until he finishes his career. Yeah, that's a temporary situation. Durante cuánto tiempo? Until he finishes the career, right? Okay, I'm reading a great book. I'm learning English. I'm taking English classes. Temporary situation. Okay, and look at this. Can be expressed with the present progressive if we feel that the situation is not permanent and will continue for a long time. Si es una situación permanente, ya saben que usamos el present simple, ¿verdad? So, for example, if you say, I'm working as a teacher. Hmm. ¿Por cuánto tiempo? Es un tiempo corto. Pero si usted sabe que es algo permanente, va a decir, I work as a teacher. So you see the difference. Yeah? Entonces, si piensa, right? If you feel, if you feel that the situation is not permanent. Remember, the situation is not permanent and it won't continue for a long time. Then you use the present continue. Pero si hay una situación permanente y usted siente que ahí se va a quedar, utiliza el present simple. Okay? For example, I can tell you, I work as a teacher. I work as a teacher. Yeah? Por qué? Por qué digo I work as a teacher y no I am working as a teacher? Because you are a teacher and you work you are working in your field. Mm -hmm. and for me it is something permanent, right? It is something permanent. Pero como el ejemplo que le daba de me he encontrado yo en mis viajes de Uber, un montón de jóvenes que andan manejando un Uber, pues son estudiantes de ingeniería. La mayoría que andan en Uber son estudiantes de ingeniería. Bueno, los, los que estudian, los que me he encontrado con estudiantes, la mayoría son estudiantes de alguna ingeniería. Right? Then you say, they say, I am driving. If I am working as a driver, as a Uber driver, until I finish my career. Yeah. So they are having a situation that is not permanent. So they are studying engineering. They are not going to be an Uber all the time, just until they finish their career. Yes. Okay, she's living in a, I'm staying with a friend this week. Will she stay with a friend 
all the rest of her life? No. It's a temporary situation, not permanent, right? She's living in Seoul for a few months. Probably later, she will go to another country or to another city, right? It's not permanent. Jack's working at a cafe until he finds a job in his head. The other was working, John was working in a bar, right? But Jack is working at a cafe. And many people, as I have told you, they are working as an Uber until they find a job in their head. Okay? I don't know if you have any question about these questions. Hmm? No question. Mm -hmm. No question? No. Okay, now you tell me your examples. Something that you're doing as a temporary situation, but you hope to finish to change in short time. Tell me. Mm -hmm. Yes. My teacher. Mm -hmm. I'm working in uh, Kahutla now. Okay. But you're not going to be in a Kahutla forever, right? No. Okay. okay. Great. Excellent. Uh -huh. Who else is having another temporary situation? Yeah. I know you're thinking, right? You're thinking, thinking, thinking. I'm teaching my class from my home. Okay. I'm teaching from home. Yeah, that is supposed that is supposed to be right. A temporary situation. Okay, great. Uh-huh. <clears throat> what else? What else? Somebody else? A ver, Yuri. Tell me a temporary situation that you have. Um, hold on, teacher. A temporary situation. Give me an example. I'm sorry. I am um I am teach anything. You're not teaching anything? Uh, an English teacher. Can you can you repeat, Judy? Let me see. I am teach English. You teaching? No, es una situación temporary. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So you said I am teaching in English. Okay. <clears throat> That's not forever, right? It's a permanent or it's um is it a permanent situation? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is it permanent or temporary? It's a temporary. It's a temporary situation. Yes. Okay, let's see. I... I'm working, taking care of patients at home. Mm -hmm. You're taking care of your home? Is that temporary? Temporary. Uh -huh. I'm working temporary, Are taking working? care of patients at home. Okay, okay. Yeah. 
right? We all teachers are passing through something temporary that has become a little longer, right? That's a teaching virtually or teaching from home. Hmm. Okay. Great. I Can I say my? my? Uh huh. Sure. I'm staying home every Friday night. Okay. You're not planning to do that forever, I see, right? Because remember, it says that if you use the present continuum related to, to a situation when you're not planning to do it permanent, right? So if you're not planning to do it permanent, then you use the present continuous. But if you're planning it to become a permanent thing, or oh, if it is something permanent, you're going to use present continuous, you're going to use the present right? Okay. Now, I'm going to move you, I'm going to take you to the manual here. Let's see. Go to page, page 38. Go to page 38 in your manual, check. Use the present continuous for temporary situations. The expressions these days and at the moment are often used to emphasize the temporary aspect of the activity. So you say, I'm reading a new book these days. What does it say in parentheses? This is, this is, why is this a temporary activity? Why? Because the person will finish reading the book. Mm -hmm. Because the person will finish reading the book, exactly. So you're not going to be reading that same book forever, right? and the book will stop being new, <laughs> right? So I'm reading a new book these days. I remember I was reading a book last year. I was reading a book and then when we began with everything virtually, I lost my book and I couldn't continue reading. So that was a very short and temporary situation. So I will have to find it again. Check, Wendy is having a meeting at the moment. The meeting is going to finish, right? It has to finish so little later. So that is temporary. We are having, or we're taking an English course. The English course will end. So you won't be in the English course forever. Right? So you can say we are studying second level at the moment. You won't be forever in second level, right? You will finish second level and you will go to third level. Yeah? So we're talking about temporary situations. Okay? Any question here? No questions. I have a question. Tell me. What about, I say, we are still breathing. We are still? Breathing. Like breathing. Mm. Breathing. Breathing as a. Respirando. Well, I will use that if I, I don't expect that to be a temporary situation. Eh? It's permanent. I will say. Mm -hmm. But what if oh, we nobody stop would, breathing? Mm -hmm. But nobody wants to stop breathing. Yeah. So. But eventually we are going to do it. Uh -huh. So remember, remember what I told you. You use the present continuous with a situation that you expect 
not to be permanent. You expect that it's not permanent. So when you say I'm still breathing, si la persona estuviera enferma de COVID, le podría ser, right? So I'm still breathing. So that's temporary. Probably, as you say, one moment you will stop. But in the case of you are healthy, you can say, I breathe. I can breathe, right? Mm -hmm. Thanks, God. We can still breathe. Yeah. Okay. So, any questions here? Questions? No questions. No. A ver, pues move your head then. I'm moving my No, head. teacher, no questions. <laughs> no questions. <laughs> we'll see. If you don't want to tell me, move your head. Move. A ver. Move your head. That's a good exercise for here. Okay. Let's see. Then let's go to page 37. Later on, we will come back here. But right now, you should go to this page. Check. Going to the conversation. Page 37. Mm -hmm. page, page 37. Ready? Ready, yes. Hi, Beth. Hi, Beth. Hi, Beth. Hi, Beth. How lo a long time no see you. Long, long time, time no see. see. How are you? How, How are, are you? you? Hello, Beth. Hello, Beth. Hello, Beth. Ever. What are you doing these days? What are you doing these days? I'm okay. Anyway. Well, I'm working on a new project. Well, I'm working, working on, on a new project. project. And also, I'm taking an English course these days. And and course, I'm, taking I'm taking an English day. course this day. What a coincidence. Oh, how about you? <laughs> how about you? How about you? That sounds great. That sounds great. 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 What a coincidence. What a coincidence. I'm also taking an English course. I'm also taking an English course. English is essential at the workplace these days. English is essential at the workplace these days. I know. I know. No. A colleague who completed the course is taking a training in England these days. A colleague, a colleague who completed the course is taking a training in England these days. You're right. You're, You're right. right. I'm studying right. on my own. I'm studying on my own. Studying on my own. I'm studying on my own, you know. I am studying on my own. On my own, you know. I'm reading novels to have better results. I'm reading novels to have better results. Read well. Read well. I'm doing listening exercise. I do listening and exercise. They help a lot. They help a lot. They help a lot. They help a lot. Okay, one more time. Hi, Beth. Hi, Beth. Hi, Beth. I'm not see. How are you? Hello, 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 Eber. Hello, Eber. Hello, Eber. How are you doing these days? What, what are you doing these days? I'm okay. I'm okay. okay. Well, I'm working on a new project. Well, I'm working on a new project. I'm on a new project. And also, I'm taking an English course these days. 
English is essential. English, English is essential. Is essential. A colleague. A colleague. 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 These days. These days. days. You're right. You're, You're right. right. You're right. You're, You're right. right. I'm studying on my own. I I'm studying on my own. My own. I'm, I'm reading novels. I am reading novels. Better results. To have better results. Better results. Better results. 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 Great. 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 Exercises. 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 Okay. Now, I'm going to be Ever and you are Beth. Okay? Ready? Hi, Beth. Long time no see. How are you? Hello. Hello, Ever. Hello, Ever. What are you doing, are you doing this day? I'm okay. Well, I'm working on a new project and also I'm taking an English course these days. How about you? That sounds great. What a coincidence. That, that sounds great. What I a coincidence. A I am also taking an English course. English, English is essential at the workplace these days. days. I know. A colleague who completed the course is taking a training in England these days. You oh, are right. right. I am studying on my own, you know. I am, I am reading novels to, to have better school. results. Great. Well, I'm doing listening exercises. They help a lot. Okay, now you are ever and I am Beth. Go ahead. You begin. One, two, three. Go. Hi, Hi Beth. Long, Long time, time no see. see. How, How are, are you? you? Hello, ever. What are you doing these days? I'm okay. I am okay. Well, well I'm I am working on a new project, project and also project. I am oh, taking an English, English course these days. How about you? That sounds great. What a coincidence. I'm also taking an English course. English is essential at the workplace these days. I know. A colleague who completed the course is taking a training in England these days. You're right. I'm studying on my own, you know. I'm reading novels to have better results. Great. Well, well I am doing listening exercises. Exercise. They, they have a lot. Okay. Excellent. Now, 
I'm going to send you to the rooms. You're going to go practice the conversation in pairs. One is going to be ever and the other is going to be bad. Okay? Ready? Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Page 37 in your manual, page 37, right? 37. Aquí vamos. Maricelano microphone. Ah, no. Okay. Oh, sí. By jam. Hmm. The attendance teacher. Sí, better before we go. Thank you, Angel. Oh, seven, seven, eight. Okay, I'm going to make the, 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 the rooms, but yes. Yes, yes, you're right. Let's go to the attendance first. Angel? Present. Aristides? Present. Denia? Present. Edwin? Present. Fatima? Hello. Present teacher. Uh, Isabel? Present teacher. Luis? Sepetio Luis? Maria? Maria? Present teacher. Maricela? Maricela? Present. Marlene? Present. Maura? Present. Lidia? Oscar? Ricardo? Teresa? Present teacher. Walter? Present teacher. Yesenia. Yesenia. And Judy. Present teacher. Having the Yesenia. Hey, teacher, I think her mom is having issues with her health. Oh. And Jesenia is taking care of her. Oh, I see. Okay, thank you. No, it was loose, right? But, okay. Well, uh, no, who told me that? Which one? Aristides. Mm -hmm. Aristides. Okay. Yes, I did. Okay, okay. Sorry, I was I was checking the attendance, still in the attendance. Okay, so well, let's hope everything is okay, right? So we can have her again. Well, I'm going to send you in pairs. I'm going to be watching you, checking that you all are able to enter the conversation, to practice the conversation. Check. First time, you practice the conversation with your partner. Then I'm going to move you, right, to another partner. You practice the conversation again with the other partner, change roles. And so the exercises, you have two questions about the conversation, yeah? Next time, La tercera vez que les cambie, compañero, van a empezar a cambiar la conversación. Cambiar preguntas, cambiar respuestas. OK? First time, only practice. Second time, practice and answer the questions. The second time. Third time, change the conversation and make your own conversation. OK? Yes, 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 no. Yes. <laughs> okay, vaya pues, allá vamos. 
But she, number page, teacher? 37. Okay, thank you. Page 37. Mm -hmm. Ready. Sí, ¿verdad? 37. Allá vamos. Ver un poco. Maria and Ricardo try to join. Okay, teacher, será que puede proyectar la imagen de la conversation? No tiene su manual por ahí. No. Para tomarle un screenshot. Va ahorita. Vaya, gracias, teacher. Okay. Y Ricardo. Ahí está Ricardo, Maura. Maura, Maura, try to join the rooms. Maura. No le Hola, sí, me sacó, me sacó la, la aplicación, creo. Mm. La voy a mover a otro y después la devuelvo al tres hoy. Cheque si le aparece. Me quedo congelada. You're right. I'm studying on my own, you know. I'm reading novels to have better results. Great. Well, I enjoy listening exercise. They help a lot. Ok. Otra vuelta para que se duele la otra cara en la otra tortilla. Otra vuelta. <laughs> Hi, Beth. Long time no see. How are you? Hi. Uh, how are you? <laughs> That sounds great. It's a coincidence. I'm also taking an English course. English is essential at the workplace this day. I know. I to complete the course in talking a training in English this day. You are right. I'm studying on my own, you know? I am reading novels to have better results. Hola, hola. Me oyó? Sí, sí, sí. Sí, yes. Okay, okay. Okay. Y you ever? Eh, la, 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 le falta, le, creo que a la página suya le falta la última parte green. Uh, well, I am doing listen to exercise. They help a lot. Comienza ahora tú. Denia. Hi, Beth. Long time no see. How are you? Hello, Edward. What are you doing this day? I am okay. Well, I am working on new project. And also, I am talking in English course these days. 
how about you? Did you finish, Edwin? Eh, teacher, I'm, I'm... Estaba con Denia y me sacó rápido, casi no, ter no terminamos. Ahorita estaba con Maura. Con Maura. Ajá. Pero no, no veo a Maura. Ahí creo que, creo que está ahí. Ahí está. Sí. Maura. Hello. Go ahead, Maura. Practice the conversation with your partner. Maura. Ando buscando la página en el manual. Page 37, Maura. No lo encuentro. Página 37. 37. 37. Ok. Hello, Eva. What are you doing these days? I am okay. Well, I am working on a new project and also I am taking an English course these days. How about you? That sounds great. What a confidence. And also taking an English course. English is a essential at the workplace these days. I know a colleague who completes the course is taking a training in England these days. You are right. I am studying on my own. You know, I am reading novels to have better, res better results. Great. Well, I am doing this listening exercise. They help a lot. Come. Say bye bye, Edwin. Buenas noches. Sí. Buenas noches. Maura. Yes. I had that high bed long time you sit one are you hello Gabriel. what are you doing these days? I done okay. Well I am working and you a new project and also I am taking an English course these days on a book do. That sound great. What a confidence. And also taking an English course. English is essential at the workplace. This teacher, I have a question. Tell, uh, tell me. As always. <laughs> uh, about we are going to answer these questions. Yes. No. Yes. Uh, I thought we were going to make the question. No, 
No, you will answer those questions. Oh, okay. And later okay. on in the in the other in the other part, in the next time, you will make your own conversation. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, what are the uh, some of the things Ever and Beth are doing these days? Uh, taking an English course is the first. Taking an English course. Yes. Taking an English course. First. Second. Uh, what thing do you have? Beth uh, is reading novels to have better results. ¿Qué, ¿Qué tienen en común? Dice, ¿verdad? No, pero esa es la segunda. Pero ah, es que la... como, ahí, como ahí dice, what are some? Significa Ajá. que hay varias, ¿verdad? Varias de las cosas que están haciendo. Exacto. Ah, sí. y, y esa es una de las cosas. Este, eh, Beth is reading. Beth is reading. Novels. Sí. To have. Sí better results even over results so uh, ever uh, ever this day i know a colleague who completed the course is taking and training in england this day you are right. I am studying in my own. You know, I am reading novels to have better results. Great. Well, I am doing listen to exercise. They help a lot. Otra back. <laughs> I am ready. Answer the questions too, right? Mande, mande, teacher. Answer, don't forget to answer the questions. Las dos preguntas que están ahí, vea, las contestó con, con Mari. Yes. Porque me, a mí me anduvo paseando como por cuatro grupos. <risa> Era <risa> nómada. Es para que no se aburra. <risa> como no vine ayer, me está castigando. <risa> no practico ayer con nadie, va a practicar con Mari. Vaya, entonces vamos a completar las dos eh, questions con Mari. Ok, Mari, the first. What are some of the things Ever and Beth are doing this day? The first question. Hello, hello. Ricardo. Ricardo, Ricardo. Ricardo. Ricardo, Ricardo, hello. Maricela, are you there? Maricela, hola, Ricardo, hello, Ricardo, ninguno está, ni Maricela ni Ricardo. No. Ajá, Ricardo. Hola, picha. No lo escucho a ninguno de ustedes dos aquí. Estaba 
eh, al inicio con Isabel. Después pues fue hace rato, yo le dije que les iba a cambiar grupo. Ajá, y luego estaba con, con dos chicas. Maristela. Ajá. Ah, pero ya sí. rato estoy aquí, no iba a practicar a ninguno de los dos. Ah, pero ahorita... No, luego eh, me lanzó a otro grupo donde está Yuri. De ahí me acaba de sacar. No, es que usted estaba en este grupo. Usted estaba conectado con dos equipos. Entonces estaba ah. en el grupo 7. Estaba con Maricela y estaba allá afuera tratando de conectarse de regreso. Entonces, por favor, sí, por eso, ah, ya. Lo mandé al grupo de Yuri porque usted solo que, ah, entonces entonces Maricela este solo me dijo permítame otra vez Maricela sí porque eh, en ese rato se me descargó el celular ¿verdad? y venía llegando me conecté a la computadora pero no tengo cámara okay. entonces fue que me pasó con Yuri ¿verdad? sí es segunda vez que nos hace eso, Maricela, que se va a otra cosa y ya no, ya no. Ya sí, porque no. como eh, iba, iba, eh, um, no sé qué, pero a practicar íbamos, este, y ahí se cambió. Hola. Hola. Eh. Hola, sí. Ay, Carla, baja el volumen. ¿no? Hola, hola, Marisela. Hola, hola. Ahora sí. Ok. Eh, sí, she be, she be long. Marisela, si le pudieran bajar volumen a la tele para que escuchen lo que están haciendo, porque ahí no logra escuchar mayor. Sí, yo, yo ya le bajé. No, no, quizá Ricardo, quizás el tuyo. Porque... No. no, pero ya no tengo. Porque sí se oye bien fuerte el volumen de la tele. Ajá. Ricardo, si usted le decía. No, 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 no. Ricardo, cheque. No, no tengo tele encendida. Ah. Pero sí se oye algo. Mucha huella. Ajá. Sí, correcto. Ahora ya se oye. Medio. Ajá, ya tiene. Vale, voy a ver que ya se les va a acabar el tiempo de, de, de práctica. Ok. Sí, Ricardo. Si ve, long time, no, no sé. How are you? Hello. Well, I don't listen. Exercises. They fell alone. Hi there. I'm Hi, music. How are you? Hello, Gabriel. What are you doing these days? I am okay. Great. I am working. And now, projects and art such. I am taking an in the schools. He say, when I that's, that's so great. What a confidence. I am also taking an English course. It's essential at the workplace these days. I got my colleagues one complete because it's a taking a training in English these days. You are right. I am studying on my own. You know, I am reading novels to have better results. Great, which I am doing listening exercises. 
they had a love. Ok, muy bien. Vaya, ya respondieron las preguntitas que están ahí abajito de la conversación. No te sé, todavía. Vaya, esas las van a responder ahorita con, con este compañero. Ok, perfecto. Teacher. Gracias. Okay, Uh, Hello, teacher. Hello, how are you doing? Ya realizamos la conversation. Ya respondieron las preguntitas. ¿Cuáles preguntas que había que responder? Preguntas? No, no se me asuste. Vamos bien, vamos bien. Tío, <risa> ¿cuáles preguntas? <risa> Para ahí abajo de la conversation ah. hay una preguntita. Que son las que usted hacer ahorita. Sí, vamos bien, no se preocupe, vamos en buen rumbo. What are some of the Ginebran that are going this day? Tan alegres que estaban. Está <risa> fácil, ¿eh? Está bien fácil. Que se están que ¿Cuáles son algunas de las cosas que ver y ver están haciendo? Exacto. Basadas en la conversación, ¿verdad? Ajá. Entonces están, más que todo, están como hablando del trabajo, ¿verdad? De un proyecto que hacen en inglés. Ah, que están tomando cursos, así como ustedes. Ajá. ¿Verdad? Para poder trabajar en ese nuevo proyecto. Uh -huh. Está trabajando okay. en un nuevo proyecto y está tomando cursos también. Cursos de inglés. Uh -huh. Very hard working people. Entonces sería they uh, they working. They are working. They are working. Este they, they are working England. They are working an English course this day. They are taking an English. Uh -huh. They are taking an English course. Ahí mencionan todas las cosas que ellos están haciendo en estos días. ¿Qué es lo que están They haciendo? They are taking. Uh -huh. They are taking English course this day. They are taking an English course. They are um, working on a new project. Ahí pueden mencionar por separado qué es lo que está haciendo cada uno, ¿verdad? They are, they are reading novels. ¿Quién? ¿Quién está leyendo? Pero, um, but who is reading novels? Beth. Ajá, Beth is reading novels. ¿Y el otro muchacho? What is he doing? Um, I think are doing are doing listening exercises. He is doing listening exercises. Yeah. Okay. Great. Entonces sería they are taking okay, days. Days. they are taking and English English courses days. Uh -huh. Y el siguiente sería Sí. What thing you do have in common with the people in the conversation? Esa pregunta es como para nosotros. Sería, dicha. No, los dos. Vaya, ¿qué es lo que tiene? Acuérdense, sí, en, la prim, en la primera ustedes van a detallar qué es todo lo que ellos hacen. Okay. Lo, qué es lo que están haciendo en estos días. Uso uh -huh. varias cosas. Y en yes. la otra, ¿qué cosas tienen ellos en común? Okay. ¿Qué están estudiando inglés? Exactly. Yes, they are taking uh, English they are course. They taking an English course, exactly. That's what they La segunda do. está bien que ponga, she's studying on my own, you know. No. She's studying on her own. Ahí le tiene que cambiar los pronouns. She's, Entonces, she's, studying, she's studying on? On her own. ¿Qué significa un por, si, por su cuenta. Ah, okay. Está estudiando por su cuenta. 
O sea, que están tomando un curso de inglés, pero por su cuenta está leyendo. ¿Verdad? Porque se acuerdan que al principio mencionó que estaba tomando curso de inglés. Pero hoy dice que ella por su cuenta está leyendo para tener mejores resultados. Entonces sería, she, she is ready también. She is reading. 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 Vaya, pero eso en la primera, ¿verdad? Porque en la segunda va a mencionar que son las cosas que ella y Ever tienen en común. Como por ejemplo usted, Teresa, que yo le preguntara, ajá, Teresa, what are you doing these days? Y usted me diría, I am preparing for the final exams. I am teaching classes visually. I am checking a lot of activities. Y le pregunta a Isabel, Isabel, what are you doing these days? Y él diría, I am traveling. I am driving for my boss. I am having fun. <laughs> I am, y, y así, ¿qué es lo que él está haciendo en estos días? Pero después mm -hmm. le pregunto, ajá. And what do you have in common? Studying English. Ajá, uh -huh. we are taking an English course. Uh -huh. Entonces ve que varía, varía la situación, ¿verdad? Y, y verdad que, ¿cómo vamos, señoritas? Ya practicamos, teacher. Ya contestaron las preguntas. La <risa> <risa> okay. Fíjense, teacher, que bah, yo más o menos había entendido eso de las preguntas y respuestas. Pero en todas las, en todas las grupitas que hicimos practicando estuvimos. Ajá. Ah, no, es que vaya. En el primer Ajá. grupito iban a practicar. Y en este Ajá. iban a practicar y a responder las preguntas. Ahorita. Eh, Ay, bastante bien. Tiempo. Okay. Estamos bien, estamos bien. <risa> Ahorita pueden responder las preguntas. Porque en la próxima, en el otro cambio, Ajá. van a hacer una conversation. Ya ahí eh. van a. Ya allí van a ir dando su propia respuesta. But, por ejemplo, what are you doing these days? Eh, o how are you? Esas son respuestas nuestras. Pero para la otra conversación, ahorita ya le comparto. Déjenme ver. Entonces, está muy mal, ¿no? Va, cheque ahorita. Como ya practicaron la conversación. Uh -huh. Van a responder estas dos preguntas. <coughs> Ah. Estas dos preguntas ahí en la misma página. Uh -huh. a responder estas dos preguntas sobre la conversación. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Eso es lo que va a hacer ahorita. Va. Bueno, gracias, Chuchet. Cuando lo vuelva a mover, entonces ya va a ser para la compra. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Entonces ahorita... Sí, creo que le voy a dar un ratitito más y después lo voy a sacar para, yo, para ponerle, para checar las preguntitas y mandarlos de nuevo. Okay. Bueno, bueno. What are some of, of things ever? Vamos a traducirlo para acá. Porque está afuera, me la sacó. Sí. Me la saco, que va a estar en aquí. Ah, pero ya vienen todos, Maura. Sí. Vamos a ver, Julie. 
ya contestamos las preguntas, Ticha, pero no sabemos si están correctas. Ah, ahorita las vamos a checar. Ahorita. ¿Eh? Por lo que terminen de volver todos. Ya. Vale. Ahí está. Check. As you practice the conversation, then you have some questions, right? Let's see the questions. What are some of the things Ever and Beth are doing these days? Who can tell me? What are uh, they are taking an English course these days? Mm, pero eso sería en la number two. Two. Entonces sería, she's studying English on his own. Okay, Beth is studying on her own. Ever working in new project and Beth taking an English course this day. Okay, Ever is working in a new project. Exacto. And that taking an English course this day. Mm. Solo Beth, only Beth is taking an English course. No. No, verdad. They have the ever. Ever two. A ver, check the next question. What things do you have in common with the people? Uh, Estamos bien. Borremos todo lo que le dije antes. Va. Beth is studying on her own. On, on, her own, on, on. A ver estas prepositions. Ok. Beth is studying on her own. Ever is working in a new project. ¿Y qué más? Los dos, ¿verdad? Aquí le vamos a poner. They are. ¿Qué están studying. haciendo? Studying English course. They are studying an English. Studying or taking? Taking. They are taking. Okay, yeah. okay. they are taking. Taking. They are taking an English course. Course. This day. Ya no sería this day teacher. Solo this. Course day. Course this. An English course. No, como ya se sabe que la pregunta dice these days. Ok, thank you. Se pueden poner Beth is studying on her own. Everybody is working in a project. They, okay. are, they are both. They are both. O sea, los dos. Beth they are both studying on her own. Sí, she is starting on her own. Ya está aquí. Es ready. ready. Okay. Este espacio. Aquí voy a poner la respuesta. Miren arriba. Beth is starting on her own. Ever is working in a new project. And they are both taking an English course. ¿Sí? A ver, ahora you. What things do you What things do you have in common with the people in the conversation? We're taking an English course, teacher. We are taking an English. We are taking. And I am working on a new project. Okay. Walter is working in a new project. Uh -huh. Is somebody else working in a new project? Only Walter. Walter and Ever. Mary, too, and working. Maria is working project. in a new project. Maria? Yeah, teacher. Okay. Do you work in the same place? No. Excuse me. 
Do you work in the same place with Walter? No, no. different place. Okay, different place, different project. Mm -hmm. So you see, what things do you have in common with the people in the conversation one? We are taking a new course. And then Walter and Maria tienen algo más todavía en común, that they are working in a new project. Is somebody reading a novel? No. Is somebody doing listening exercises? Teacher, uh, I was going to say that we also are doing listening exercises because when you pronounce it in the correct way and then we try to do it like you do. Okay, okay. So we are also doing we are doing listening the exercises. exercises. Good. Good good. Okay. Nobody's reading a novel. Vamos a ver. Hmm. No? Okay, those are the only activities. Very good. Okay. ¿Qué vamos a hacer hoy? Los voy a mandar de nuevo. Pero esta vez vamos a usar las... Pueden usar las preguntas, ¿verdad? Hey, hey. Hi, Isabel. Long time no see. How are you? Isabel says, hi, Walter. Oh, hello, Walter. What are you doing these days? And Walter says, I'm working in a new project. And I'm also taking an English course these days. <laughs> and le queda igual, verdad? No le cambia mayor cosa. How about you? Well, that sounds great. What a coincidence. I'm taking an English course too. Pero le cambia. Okay, le puede decir I am... No sé, I am visiting new clients, right? O I am doing. Ahí vean qué cosas cambian. En el caso de Walter, pues ni modo, queda igual, ¿verdad? Eh, porque está trabajando en un new project y también está tomando un English course. ¿Ya? Pero hagan ahí todos los cambios posibles. Pueden usar las mismas preguntas. Tomen la conversación como base y espontáneamente den sus propias respuestas, ¿verdad? Vale, lo voy a mandar con un nuevo compañero y esperemos que Zoom me los mande con un nuevo compañero. Vamos a ver. Fátima no ha trabajado con Maura, ¿verdad? No. Sí. Sí, ya trabajó con Maura. Sí, ya he trabajado. Volvamos a crear. A ver. Ajá, Maricela Ricardo, si ya estuvieron juntos. Funes, Maura Ricardo, no, ¿verdad? Aristides con Fátima. No. Walter con Yuri. Vaya. No, no hemos trabajado. Marlene y Teresa. No, ¿verdad? No. No. Ángel y Denia. Ángel Ángel. No, no. Isabel y Marisela. No, ¿verdad? Edwin y Mari. Sí. Sí. Vamos a mover entonces a... Me llevo aquí, me llevo. Va. Va, Maricela se queda con Edwin y Mari con Isabel. Va. Bueno. Mari, allá vamos. No se me vayan a perder, oye, que cuando los vaya a ver, quiero ver que ahí están. Y que están siguiendo instrucciones. Vaya, vamos. Remember, make your own answers, right? Give your own answers here.
Ricardo, try to join. Vaya, remember, están usando, pueden usar las mismas preguntas, pero su respuesta, ¿verdad? Sobre ustedes. Ajá. Vamos, ready, Maura. Hello, Ricardo. How are you? No, yo. Uh, eh, teacher, la, las preguntas que aparecían en la, en la... The conversation, Ricardo. A la conversation, van. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Ya las otras preguntas, ya, ya, este ya. Tú. Ok. Siempre íbamos a trabajar entonces con el, lo que estábamos practicando anteriormente con, con los demás compañeros. Ajá, pero la diferencia es que aquí usted puede dar, la, va a dar sus propias respuestas, no las respuestas del libro. Ajá. Ok. Yes. Entonces, how are you, Maura? Maura? Study English? I am fine. I am working on my job. And how about you? Yo soy maestro. I'm preparing the final classes. Hi, teacher. Algo, algo así es la tarea, ¿verdad? Yeah. Ok. Vamos bien. Entonces, entonces, eso sería lo que yo estoy haciendo, ¿verdad? Y ahora va, vamos a... Y ya cuando le dice, how about you, ya le dice Fátima lo que ella está haciendo también. Exacto. Entonces, solo voy a copiar, voy a copiar este, el de, para que sea, tengamos una base, ¿verdad? Vamos a ver, ahí está. That sounds great. What a coincidence, lo de... Podría contestar también en good o algo así, ¿verdad? Porque ahí es como... Qué bien, ¿verdad? Coincidencia. Exacto. In the house, the my boss, house the beach, the my boss, working. Uh, I am here one month, one month here working and return and the city, San Salvador in eight of November. Así es, ¿verdad, Tiche? The 8th of November. You coming back on the 8th of November. Of November. Yeah, my, in my house. You're going to stay one month in Acajutla. Yes, in Acajutla. Work. How do you like it? Do you like being in Acajutla? Do you like? Es que, como, ay, me tra, 
Ah, sí. ¿Qué es lo que más le sí. gusta de acá? Me gusta estar yeah. en me gusta, yeah, yes, yes, I like, I like in Acajutla, eh, house, um, here is comfortable. It's comfortable, you have a comfortable yes. house. Sí, les daré un, eh, no sé cómo se dice, un, cómo se dice, una vista, <laughs> donde estoy. Ok. Oh. oh, wow. That's why you like it. It's so yeah. beautiful. Mm-hmm. Ahí está mi jefe. Ahí está mi jefe. Ay, por eso vi por ahí un pez. Sí, está. Es un pez vela. Ajá, ajá. Qué okay, nice. It's a beautiful uh, Cajutla. It's, yes. um, yeah. it's um restaurant um hotel. Hotel de Cameroon. Uh, I a uh, house beautiful in the Salinitas residential. Mm -hmm. You're in Salinitas. Uh, yeah, in Salinitas. In my work, uh, after the tomorrow is underwater every day. Wow. Tomorrow, uh, hasta 7th of November. You will be underwater all this time until November. Eso. Oh. Gracias nice. por corregirnos. <laughs> <laughs> Estamos haciendo nuestros pininos aquí con Yuri. Hey, nice, nice. Nos ha salido yeah. bien porque hemos conversado con Yuri. Exactly. Tal vez no, no sobre la conversación, pero sí hemos estado. No, and that's the idea. That's the idea that you that you make it yours, right? Porque no tiene sí. chiste que, que, que lea así como que exactamente lo que la conversation dice, sino que sí. la idea es que puedan expresarlo. Que empecemos a practicar como compañeros y empezar a fluir nuestro inglés. Exacto. Exacto. Sí, sí, sí. Pero sí, ahí estamos. Así que aquí. Ayer no me pude conectar, teacher, porque me estaba mudando. Oh. You were changing to that, to that house. Sí. That's good. That's good. The new house. The new house. Months. For the month, right? For the month. Mm -hmm. Yes, for the month. That's nice. Enjoy it. <laughs> okay, well, I will go see how the others are doing. Continue chatting, right? Okay. Thank you, Bishop. Okay. Hi, hi. Hi, hi. Aquí estamos tratando de cambiar unas cosas que donde dice que en vez de que esté estudiando por su propia cuenta, pues suele tratar de poner que está estudiando eh, por medio de una beca de inglés corporativo gratuitamente. Ah, ya, yeah, sure. Sure. The answer is you are right. I am studying for free through corporate, corporate ah. English. Y donde dice que estoy leyendo novelas, obviamente puedo ponerle obras, ¿verdad? O libros. Claro. I'm reading my uh -huh. homework, my, my students' assignments. <laughs> I, am, I am reading, ¿qué? Las my book. Tareas, las tareas. Uh -huh. I am reading. We've been reading a book. A book, verdad? You're reading a book? A book. The English. In English? The English. In English, verdad? Are you reading an English book? Yes. Ah, uh -huh. I am reading a book in English, verdad? I'm reading a book in English, yeah. To have better results. To have better results, exactly. Have better results, okay. Y donde también decía en la conversación, um, I know a college that completes the course we're taking. 
a training in Aleman, Alemania this day. Germany. Puede cambiar. Germany. Germany. Ajá, no, pero como no es solo por cambiarlo, sino que qué es lo que ustedes están haciendo. ¿Qué estamos ahorita haciendo? Uh -huh. Entonces sería... No en Inglaterra, sino que, que acá en El Salvador. Sí. ¿O cómo? Sí, ¿verdad? ¿Qué, ¿Qué complete es? the course is taking a training in, in El Salvador. In El Salvador. O puede decir, we are taking a training with inglés corporativo in El Salvador. También ahí, aunque se repita abajo también. Sí, no. In inglés we corporativo. Are Uh, aunque no sé Teresa si yo pongo donde dice ver como íbamos haciendo un párrafo Ajá. y lo vamos cambiando Ajá. usted me dijo hi iba a poner mi nombre y yo Ajá. iba en el otro con usted y así iba y aquí es donde los hemos quedado porque puedo como sigo ver mmm, vea porque ahí puedo decir to arrive, allá en student, eh, clínica laboratory, eh, allá, mm, porque es algo que yo quiero, <ríe> primero Dios, Ajá. en este año. ¿Qué es lo, qué es lo que está estudiando? Eh, no, en este año, laboratorio, eh, laboratorio clínico. clínico. Okay, okay. Ah, bueno. Vea, entonces. Y de ahí pongo, I am ready a book, sería book libro, dicho. Ajá, uh -huh, a book. I'm ready uh, a book in English. A book a two. But, y ahí dejo to have very, para very result. To have para very result. Exactly. Uh -huh. Pues usted está leyendo muchos libros también. Uh -huh. Estoy leyendo muchos libros. Puede cambiarle que para tener mejores resultados, puede decir que para aprender más. ¿Verdad? To learn more. Sí. Ya ahí pueden, ustedes pueden cambiarle y adaptarlo pues a lo suyo, ¿verdad? A la información propia. El chichi. Sí. Me los Entonces quedaría como tú le armó. Sí, sí, pueden decir eso no problema. Bien. Pero yo estaba, estaba perdido en lo, si no lo sí. escribía me iba a perder. Así es. Vaya. Hello. Hello. Uh, we write the, the conversation. Excellent. We write. Bye. Ahorita me toca a mí. Es, sí. It's my turn. Okay. Uh, yo le voy a decir. ¿Qué le puedo responder? Veamos. Great. Le voy a poner. Great. In my job, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We, en un minuto. Okay, teacher. In my we job, are, we are um, Okay, coming, coming. Ya vinieron todos, que me queda perdido. Vamos a ver. Ok. 
Ok. Bueno, ahí estamos. Very good. I want to hear a couple of volunteers. A ver, a ver. I was, I was listening to you and that's good to hear you. That you have your plans, you have your, your things and you can adapt, how you can adapt, what you do or what are you doing these days and changing uh, the conversation, right? One volunteer. Well, one pair. Can I? Can I? Sure, this it is. Uh, Fatima and I. Okay, good. Good. Okay, Fatima. Uh, can I share the screen? Sure. Sure. Okay. Sure. Yes. Okay. Okay. Comienzo, uh, Fatima. Yes. Hi, Fatima. Long time no see. How are you? Hello, students. What are you doing these days? I'm okay. Well, I am preparing the final classes. And also, I am taking an English course these days. How about you? That's so great. What constitutes I, I am also taking in English course. English is indispensable at the workplace these days. I know. An ex-student of mine completed a course and she is working in a call center now. You are, you're right. I am taking class online at 8 p.m. to 10 p.m. You know, I am learning a lot. The teacher is really good. Great. Well, I am also learning a lot. My teacher is really good too. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Aristides, choose one more pair. One. Uh, I want to hear uh, Teresa and her partner. Teresa. Teresa. Mr. Walter, you want it. <laughs> <laughs> Con Marlin me tocó. Okay. Hola. <laughs> bueno, Marlene, démosle, intentémosle. Hi, Marlene. Long time no see. How are you? Hello, Teresa. What are you doing this day? I am okay. Well, I am working on a new terms. I also I am taking an English course this day. How about you? That second grade, what a consonant I also take an English course in English is essential in the workplace day. I know a colleague co who completed the course is taking a training in English corporation this day. You are right. I am a student clinical laboratory. Uh, I read a book to have excellent result. Great. Well, I am reading in this book to understand more. More. Understand more. Yeah. Ooh, very good. So you see? Yeah. Um, you can do it, Teresa. <laughs> you see? Isabel y Angel. Okay. Oh, Angel, no sé cómo. Isabel and Angel. My partner is Denia. Okay. No, okay. my partner is Denia. Oh, con, okay. Con Denia, ajá, no sé ahí cómo. <laughs> Se salvó Isabel. <laughs> okay. Comenzó yo. Hi, Denia. Nice to see you. How are you? Hello, Angel. Nice to meet you too. I am very good. And you, what are you doing these days? I'm okay. Well, I'm working a, on a new project and also, and I taking an English, an English course there. And I'm working in the exam for a senior. How about you? Thanks. Thanks so great. What are 
coincidence. I am also an English course. English is important in my job. Great, in my job, we are working on graduation celebrate. Hasta ahí Interesting. Ah, bueno. <laughs> okay, le agregó, le agregó. Nice. <laughs> Sorry. Nice, nice. Interesting. Uh, in my work, we are about to deliver annual project closer reports. Finish. Excellent. Finish. Very good. Very good. You see? So we are done for today. Nice. I want to choose one more people. <laughs> one more. <laughs> ya sabemos a quién me escoger. <laughs> Vamos a ver. Yo sé de quién le está tirando. Yo sé quién le está tirando. Sí, sí. Not ah. Luis, not Luis, because he, he talking in English, in, in, in Chinese today. Chinese. <laughs> <laughs> Or the bassin. <laughs> No, but it was not the Chinese one, the one he got. Okay, let's see. Angel, tell me present. Present. Aristides? Present, teacher. Denia? Present, teacher. Edwin? Present, teacher. Fatima? Present, teacher. Abel? Present teacher. Luis. Present teacher. Maria. Present teacher. Maricela. Present teacher. Marlene. 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 Present teacher. Present teacher. Aura. Present. Nidia. No Nidia. Oscar. Ricardo Ricardo Por ahí andaba Teresa Present teacher Present teacher Present teacher Yesenia Present teacher Present teacher Ok Good Good, good, good bueno, hoy le toca quedarse a Ricardo. Oscar, a Ricardo no, a Oscar. Hey. Mañana le toca a Ricardo. Tomorrow. ¿Hay algún okay. voluntario que se quiere quedar en vez de Oscar? Volunteer, big team. No volunteer. Bueno, see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. See you tonight, tomorrow, everybody. Everybody. God bless you. Nice to meet tomorrow. you. Good night, Mr. Walter. Nice to meet you. Thank <laughs> you. Take care. See you tomorrow. No olviden la platform. No. Hello, Luis. No. <laughs> I, don't, I don't forget the platform. <laughs> no, forget the platform. Yes. Okay. Sí, Good, night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.